Hi, hello, TikTok. Today is a moon day, and it's a very special moon day indeed. It's a Virgo new moon. So, these are your cards for your moon day reading. Udo, transformation. Gemini, I think. Fifth house, creativity. So what I take this to mean for us this week, and especially with this moon day, this Virgo new moon, is a change in the way we think about our creativity. Now, if you are familiar with my work and my practice, uh, you will know that I'm a big proponent of finding your own path, your spiritual path, and following that path, and that when you do that, that is quite possibly the most creative thing that you could do, especially as a human. Um, it feels like our current religious setup in the United States especially, but more really Western culture, is uh, a dampening of our creativity, uh, not being allowed to use our own creativity, our own creative mind to make new traditions or to discover old traditions and figuring out how to apply those to our modern day. So what I really understand for these cards this week is if you have been told, if you have internalized the message that you are not a creative person, spending time with yourself and your spiritual path, finding that and following it is probably the most creative thing that you could be doing right now. So, if you have not done that, or if you're currently on that, this is your message to start or keep going. Because it's really important. Our ancestors, where we come from, and the people and places that have molded and shaped us really do have a lot to say. And whether you have inherent knack for talking to the dead or listening to the dead. Venerating your ancestors is something that anyone and everyone can do, regardless of hearing voices or seeing certain messages. Dead will find a way to talk. So, find your creative spark. Listen to what's inside of you that tells you what to do promise it won't really lead you that astray because it's where you come from and you are creative